This is an ABC 10 News update. Hello there, I'm Virginia Chaw with this ABC 10 News update. A family of five now displaced after their home caught fire in Carlsbad. That blaze broke out about 1.30 this morning on Circular Sequoia. Officials say the fire destroyed the garage of the two-story home. Neighbors were evacuated as precaution as firefighters worked to put out this fire. No reports of any injuries. The Red Cross is now helping the family and their dog. No word on the cause of that fire. Day six of the trial of the U.S. Navy sailor accused of setting the fire that ravaged USS Bonham Richard. Prosecutors rested their case on Friday. This morning, the defense set to call its witnesses. Last week, multiple witnesses testified that Seaman Ryan Mays made it known he was unhappy on deck duty and wanted to get back to Navy SEAL training. If convicted, Mays could face life in prison. Congressman Darrell Issa says he's continuing to help a small East County community that has been under a boil water order since May. Our investigative team first reported the issues at Butterfield Ranch in Julian a couple of weeks ago. The hundreds who live there under the order because of E. coli contamination. The owner of the property is still working on upgrading the water system. In the meantime, over the weekend, Congressman Issa and his staff delivered 15 pallets of bottled water to the neighbors. All right, let's talk about this warming trend that we're under now, Vanessa. Uh, yeah, unfortunately, it feels like we just can't catch a break, right? Especially as we entered fall. So we have an excessive heat warning uh, right now in place for the desert areas. Meanwhile, heat advisory set to take place at the 10 a.m. hour for the beaches and inland areas lasting until Wednesday night. Temperatures are going to rise quick as we get through your morning and afternoon. We'll be in the 80s by 10 o'clock by this afternoon in the 90s and we'll be in the 80s along the beaches. Virginia. Thanks, Vanessa. For the latest news, weather and traffic, just go to 10news.com where you can download our free app from your app store. For ABC 10 News, I'm Virginia Chaw.